Let's do the hula. Spin and shout till you find yourself on Zula. Let's take off. We're all ready to roll. It's fun to learn with the Zula Patrol. Wake up, Gorga. It's time to play. Come on, Captain Bula. Let's welcome the day. Where's that cedar? Ready to go. Wizzy and Wig are good to glow. Speakers bubbling, turning blue. Mortals making something new. Way, way out where the planets do the hula. Spin and shout till you find yourself on Zula. See your round balls at Mission Control. It's fun to learn with the Zula Patrol. Way, way out where the planets do the hula. Spin and shout till you find yourself on Zula. See your round balls at Mission Control. It's fun to learn with the Zula Patrol. Space, it's what's between your toes. Well, not counting sock lint. I really love fall on Zula. It's so colorful when the leaves change. And we have to rake them up. Oh, this old rake sure is rusty. Well, rust is just the normal chemical reaction. In fact, the leaves turning color is also a chemical reaction. Have you seen our water pitcher? We want to make lemonade. And oatmeal raisin cookies. Yum! Um, sounds great, but sorry, I haven't seen your pitcher. You know, baking cookies is a chemical reaction, too. Um, what's a chemical reaction? Let's find out in the Multopedia. <laughs> to understand chemical reactions, you need to know that all matter is made up of tiny particles called atoms. So tiny that even a regular microscope can't see them. Iron guy to the rescue. Check out these Zula patrollers. These are iron atoms. I'm made out of a bunch of them. Just like the metal teeth on my rake. Right. There are all kinds of atoms. Aluminum and oxygen and silver and lots more. And when atoms combine, they form molecules. Like when hydrogen and oxygen atoms combine to form water molecules. All matter is made up of atoms and molecules. And chemistry is the study of matter and its changes. You bet. Look what happens when the oxygen atoms in water meet up with iron atoms. That's called a chemical reaction. The iron combines with the oxygen to form something new. Iron oxide. Usually called rust. And when a substance undergoes a chemical change, a new kind of substance is produced, which is often a lot different than the original one. Iron, iron oxide, iron. Oxide! Iron! Oxide! Check out what happens with apples. Another chemical reaction. Bingo! Fruit turns brown when it's opened up to oxygen in the air. It's almost like the fruit rusts. <laughs> but it still tastes good. So is that what happens to the leaves every fall? Exactly! The chemicals in the leaves react to the change in the weather, causing beautiful colors, something new. Now I want to make our own chemical reactions by baking oatmeal raisin cookies. I love science. <laughs> There's one thing I don't get, Malto. How do different substances combine to make something new? Hmm. Perhaps the easiest way to explain it is to see it firsthand with the sizerizer. Um, um, um. Ready? We're going to shrink down to the size of atoms. Wow! Now I'm really the smallest one in my family! Fascinating! Just look at those hydrogen atoms! Yoo-hoo! Would you two mind getting together with that oxygen atom over there? Sure, no problem. Hey, we're all gases, right? The hydrogen atoms combine with the oxygen atom, making something new, a molecule of water. That's a chemical reaction. Hey, that was fun. 
I want to do that. Me too. <laughs> uh, wait, wait, not so many. Whoa! Hey, there's our pitcher. Moto must have borrowed it to water his worms. It's Wizzy and Wig, wobbling wombats. We're floating in the water pitcher. We'd better get bigger before. Oh, no! Oh, the remote control! Don't worry, I'll get it! I couldn't reach it! Wizzy! Wig! Down, Down here! here. Hello. Wizzy! Wizzy. Wig. Wig! We're too small for them to hear us. Ready to squeeze some lemons. Watch out! Falling fruit! That should be enough sugar. Don't want too much. Oh! No! oh hey! Now what? Without the remote and no way to contact Wizzy and Wig, we might stay this size forever. Well, at least we'll be lemony fresh. Here. Help me paddle. Wow. What are you writing? Just a reminder, we're out of cheese. Best if used by... Oh, gee, that was last summer. Oh, tell me about it. My, the milk has turned quite sour. Another chemical reaction. Look, the bacteria are breaking down the milk. They grow by eating the sugar and protein in the milk. The process forms gas, a chemical reaction. That's why it smells. Yipe, it looks like they want to put Zula patrollers on their menu. Don't worry, we're safe now. Ah! Eggs, raisins, oatmeal, baking soda, now stir it. Whoa! 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 mix before it gets baked. That's one chemical reaction I do not want to experience firsthand. <laughs> well, this is weird enough. Now where are we? My old catcher's mitt. Why, I haven't seen that since I was playing catch with... with... Gorga. Oh my gosh! We're, We're inside, inside Gorga! Gorga! Mix up another batch. Aww. Maybe you better wait in Moto's lab till we're done. By the way, you see the color on this silver frame? It's tarnish, a chemical reaction of oxygen with silver. It's like a slower version of rust, but with silver, not iron. Handy information. But have you noticed where we are? Oh, right, right. We need to get out of here. Whoa! Look, another chemical reaction. Gorga's stomach is digesting or breaking down the stuff in the cookie mix and forming something new. If we don't get moving, we'll be digested too. This looks like a job for the Zula Patrol. Jump! Wearing Gorga in his tummy makes you wonder if we're yummy. I'm not feeling very rested. Hope we don't end up digested. Chemistry notes matters, changes, and the way it rearranges leaves turn colors nice distraction, but it's also a chemical reaction. Hearing Gorga in his belly, there's my old socks, they're still smelly. Now a chemist studies matter, I'm still sticky from swimming round in batter. 
something on a science TV show about a giant fizz made by mixing vinegar with baking soda. A chemical reaction like that might just fizz us right out of here. Oh, too bad we haven't got that stuff. Well, I do have a bottle of vinegar in my pocket. You have vinegar? You never know when you're gonna need to make an emergency salad. Well, that's solved, but we don't have any baking soda. Sure we do. Whitney put it in the cookie mix, remember? You're right. Then we'll just mix them and get ready for blast off. Just say we've been looking at Gorga from a whole new angle. Huh? Want some lemonade? No thanks. Been in there, done that. Uh, okay. Will you put our cookies in the oven for us? Sure. And I know exactly what went into them. But first, I have something important to do. Toss out that spoiled milk. Good idea. That's one chemical reaction we do not want in our refrigerator. I think I'll go buy some cheese. Huh? What'd I miss? The show's over. Did the good guys win? Uh, could we run it again? Welcome to the Molto Moment. With the and Wig, I congratulate you on an excellent chemical reaction. The baking of your oatmeal raisin cookies. <laughs> hey, where's Gorga? He shrunk down to show us that all matter is made of atoms and molecules. And when matter undergoes a chemical change, a different new kind of substance is produced. <laughs> like when oxygen and hydrogen come together to make water molecules. And chemistry is the study of matter and how it changes. Gee, too bad Gorga's too small to get a cookie. There's only one left. Oh, my. Time to make another batch. See you next time. 